Once you feel like you're moving better without your shoulder bothering you as much, then it's time to gradually strengthen that connection where the bone attaches to the cartilage. And this needs to be done with easy range of motion exercises that don't stress out your shoulder because it can easily detach again. You've got to give it some time. What I recommend to patients to use is a shoulder pulley system like this one. So you hang this over your door and then you use the pulleys to reach up and down, assisting your injured shoulder with your good arm so that you can pull up into higher ranges of motion. Once you feel like you can move comfortably with your shoulder and you've gotten more normal with your everyday activities, last comes strengthening the muscle imbalance properly so that you can get your shoulder health as high as possible and prevent another shoulder injury, another labrum tear, or some other related problem like a biceps tendon tear. People also suffer nerve injuries in their neck and shoulder from the same muscle imbalance that causes a labral tear. Fixing the root muscle imbalance is key to making sure you prevent other shoulder problems from coming on in the future.